What's up, Zia Squad? It's your girl Z Queen back with another video, and today I am doing another collaboration. And I'm pretty sure you guys know who it's with Missy, the Beauty Diva. If you guys are oldie but goodies, you guys know a few months ago, me and Missy, the Beauty Diva, did part one of this video, and that was 10 random facts about us. And we wanted to share another additional 10 random facts about us, and we are so excited. So, this is part two. We decided to wait a few months, you know, spread it out a little bit, but we're back and ready to go. So be sure to go check out her video and show her some love. Let's take a quick look of what you can expect in her video. I can actually recite it from line to line. Like my favorite line out of five heartbeats is how it feels to be me. Alright y'all, so by that I know y'all excited, so go check out her video you guys are going to love it okay she always shows up and shows out and while you guys are over there be sure to hit that subscribe button and thumbs up and tell her I sent you guys she's trying to reach 500 subscribers and so am I girl so while you here go ahead and hit that subscribe button thumbs up and leave a comment down below alright Z squad let's get right into it so <laughs> These are really random, but here we go. My first random fact is that my dream career is social media management and communications um, or social media marketing. I really love social media, so I want to do something with it. And I always felt like social media management would be a really cool, cool career. But I'm mean, like, girl, hold up. A few months ago when you did this the last time, you said you want to be an educator. You didn't see that video? Take a look. Number five, I want to be an educator. Yes, girl, I know. I said I want to be an educator, but after Girls Who Code, which I filmed that video right before Girls Who Code, after Girls Who Code, my mindset kind of changed, and I just started seeing different careers for me. So that's my new career venture I'm hoping to go down. Now, that's not saying it won't change, but you know, right now it's where your girl is. Number two is Steph. Curry is my favorite celebrity basketball player. Maybe my favorite celebrity athlete. Like, I love Steph Curry. Oh my god, y'all. I have such a big obsession with Steph Curry that people are like, you know he's married. I'm like, yes, honey. I love Aisha. I love their kids, Ryan and Riley. Like, I love the whole Curry family. I just, I love the Currys. I feel like they're so humble, down to earth. And, like, one thing I can always say about him is he's always thanking God. Like, he's like, God gave me this. God gave me the power to do this. And that, I admire that, that he is always giving back to the one who gave to him first. So, yes, Steph Curry is my guy right there, you know. I used to be a LeBron fan. When LeBron left the Heat, I was like, mm -hmm, boy, guy. And I found Steph Curry. I was like, you is my new, you is me. We are one and the same. We get each other. Like, I'd be like, in the games where he's not doing enough Steph, pull yourself together. Let's get it. You know, mine, we're going through the mines, you know. And then it's like, he does good, right? <laughs> Yeah, y'all, I love Steph Curry that much. <laughs> Number three, I had a celebrity interaction, y'all. This was right after I filmed the last video. It was like a week or two later. I had a celebrity interaction with the one and only Charles Barkley. Y'all, I was standing, standing there and I was like, who is this guy? And, and then I was like, oh my God, that's Charles Barkley. And he was like, hi, how are you? And I was like, good, how are you? You know, he was in a rush. We can have a full conversation, but it was still a celebrity interaction, okay? Don't just cut my interaction short. We connected eye to eye, and I was like, oh my God, it's Charles Barkley. Because who doesn't love Charles Barkley? Like, I love Charles Barkley. So shout out to you, Charles. If you ever find the video, that's the girl you saw, you know? You saw me. You were on a rush to go to an interview, but you saw me. Okay, number four. I am a founder of Black Girl Magic of YouTube. More than likely, you guys already know that because I've made videos about it. It's in my every description box. I have a link down to the YouTube channel and to the Facebook group. But if you are a black female YouTuber, join my group. We're helping each other define our own success, spread positivity. So yes, y'all, join the group if you are a black female YouTuber. I'm so happy 
Fun fact, Missy the Beauty Diva is one of my beautiful admins over in that group. So we connect on that level too. Like we have like like-minded business goals. Like she like really was all up in like all ready to go with this. She was like, let's do it, let's go. I'm supporting you with this. And yeah, y'all. She was the first member of the group. She saw everything being constructed like she saw the hard work I put into that group and I'm so very thankful. Number five, my favorite song is called Lit Right Now and it's by Ayo and Tayo. Let's take a quick listen. <laughs> y'all I love that song so if you guys have not heard that song go check it out the reason I love this song is just because it's like one of those songs like if you're like in a not in a good mood or if you just like want something to pump you up if you're already pumped and you want to get pumped up even more this is like one of those songs you can put on and get going like I'm trying to do a workout and I'm just struggling I put this song and I'm like yeah like <laughs> my friends will tell you it's on repeat like I just repeat 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 for like three times and then I'm gonna move on but yeah I love Ayo and Tao number six my favorite season is the current season and that is a fall I know I have some international viewers so maybe for you guys it's not fall but right now in the United States it is fall time it's finally like today was actually the first day we get in fall weather it's the coolest day it's been since May and I am loving it like I love the way the um, leaves change and the leaves fall and I just love it like the crisp weather being able to wear this color this wine color that I love oh so much like I just love everything about fall for the most part number seven is I love this designer named Betsy Johnson I wear her stuff so much I have like two of her bags sitting here right next to me. Another one sitting across from me. Actually two across from me. Like I have a lot of Betsy Johnson bags. One day I'm going to do a Betsy Johnson haul of everything I have Betsy Johnson. I love her so much. Her style is great. Some of her stuff is a little far fetched. But for the majority of it I'm like yes Betsy. Yes girl. Yes. Number eight. I hate bananas. I hate bananas. Like the smell of bananas. The sight of bananas. The taste of bananas. The sound, like when people bite into bananas, like everything like about a banana just grosses me out. Like if I see a person eating a banana, I'm like, cringing. Like you want a banana? No, girl. Put, take the telephone somewhere else. Like I don't like bananas. And I think I used to eat them when I was little, but like ever since I've really been able to say for myself, like what I like and what I don't, I haven't eaten them. I have not eaten those things in years, and they disgust me. The taste of it in a smoothie, like if someone puts it in a smoothie, I'm like, ah, oh, no. Nah, can't eat that I don't like bananas like that's the point of where it is number nine I love YouTube y'all I am pretty much like addicted to YouTube like when someone asks me what my favorite TV show is I have to think about it because I watch YouTube so much like I love watching YouTube and exploring and just kind of seeing like what everyone does differently how everybody lives their lives differently like people using their creativity I just love YouTube it's something like YouTube is so beautiful there's stuff that's in YouTube and on YouTube that annoys me like just there are certain things on YouTube that just annoy me like some of the rules and stuff but for the most part I love YouTube I feel like it's a great place it is really populated right now but YouTube me and you we cool Last one, number 10, is my favorite color. It's rose gold, y'all. Um, rose gold, pink. Like, I just love the pink shades. And to me, rose gold is like an addition to pink. Like, I got pink nails right now. I'm wearing a rose gold ring. It's just not going to focus. But I'm wearing a rose gold ring. Bling, bling, honey. Yes, bling it out, honey. I've got rose gold earrings on. The back of my phone is like a rose gold color. So, I just love rose gold. I love pink, rose gold, and all that. So you guys, those are my 10 random facts. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to go check out my girl, Miss C the Beauty Diva. Go show her some love. We are so excited to do this collaboration to do part two for you guys. So don't forget to go over there, show her some love, hit that subscribe button, and sh show her that the Z Squad is here to support her, okay? Go be a beauty diva over there, okay? That's what she calls her subscribers, the beauty diva. So go be a beauty diva, okay? 
And over here you're a Z Squad member, but from the Z Squad you gotta go show her, you know, that we're there to support, okay? We're, we're, we're a family unit, okay? Me and Missy Beauty would get along so well. Whenever we like interact like online where we're messaging about a collab or just casual messaging, like we get along so well and she's so inspiring. So go show her some love over there. Help her reach her goal of 500 subscribers and help me reach my way over here too. Alright guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys came from Missy the Bee Divas channel, thank you so much for coming. Be sure to hit that subscribe button so you can be part of the Z Squad too. And I will see you guys in my next video. I love you. Bye.